Hello 3D printer peeps. I'm sitting here in Bamboo Studio and today I just want to show you quickly a way to name your own custom filaments. For example, you may be using generic PLA and generic PLA for your non-bamboo PLA. Maybe you've assigned a color, but I'm going to show you how to assign a name. So for example, this is JAO Silk Silver PLA Plus. And this is ESUN PLA Plus. Go over here, you'll see this is the brown one right here. Of course, to change the color, just click on that color square and you'll see I have brown chosen. To change the name, we are gonna click right here, click to edit preset. You will see this brings up a menu with several options. And the first thing you see highlighted is the type. I am going to change this to PLA plus below this type you will see many other settings such as the recommended temperature how much it costs per kilogram the temperature you are currently using to print this filament and then when you are all done setting this up as you want you will press save right here is where you will add the name so this is light brown eSun PLA plus Go ahead and press OK. When you close this, you will notice the name has changed to light brown eSun PLA Plus. In my bamboo studio, you may notice it also changed my silk silver to this new filament. So you can go ahead and put it back to what it was, which was generic PLA silk. However, you can go ahead and click edit on that. You can decide if you would like to change the type you are not allowed to add spaces. You would have to do silk underscore PLA. However, up here, of course, you will change the name by saving this and doing JAO silk silver PLA plus and pressing OK. Close it out, and now you've got light brown eSun PLA Plus and JAO Silk Silver PLA Plus. And that's how you go ahead and add all of your special filaments that you like to work with. So the names represent something that you can easily recognize.